great to be back at the Science Museum for the annual Ritchie Lecture. It's very important for Urenco to actually run this lecture to encourage kids to get involved in STEM subjects. We love the, the Ritchie Lecture at the Science Museum. It's a great example of informal learning and those are the subjects that we really need more students to be studying to find the solutions to the problems that we're facing today. It's a fantastic opportunity for children to come out of the classroom to come and see science in a different context. It's not always an opportunity that every child has. Having Urenco do the Ritchie Lecture every year means that they learn about science through play and through interacting and activities. Dr Ken's presentation was absolutely amazing. The idea of today's lecture is for all the students to leave here loving science. And we had students coming down, they were participating, asking fantastic questions and also thinking about what contribution they could make and become the next generation of scientists. Well, they're in there screaming. <laughs> you know, they're, they're running around, they're excited, they're touching everything, they're pulling, they're smelling, they're, you know, so they're, they're really, really engaging with it. The experiment, it was good to watch and I, I loved it. Yes, I'm very into science. I always want to learn new things about it. I like science because of chemistry. My favourite thing was like when we did the lecture, Professor Ken, he did it in a, like an attracting way, like in different in lessons. Teaching us about like how carbon dioxide can affect the world and much more. I liked the lectures and the quiz a lot and I learned a lot as well. We found we can play with uh, things that were there. It was much better than school. I got to learn all these different things that I haven't learned before, and it was really an amazing experience. Well, I think it's important that companies like Murenko encourage the next generation, because without them, we don't have a future. Because like me, they are committed to the next generation of scientists who want to improve the world and also just create great science.